a nightmare. On Elm Street 3, Dream Warriors has Kristen go to uh, an insane asylum and and meets a lot of friends there because uh, they were all having strange dreams. So, the positives on this film are the characters are memorable. I like Kristen as the protagonist. Uh, she's really cool. She really stands out. Is she say as better is, is she better than nancy i mean no because i think nancy has a lot more to do in the first film so i do think Kristen is still a good protagonist i prefer nancy but Kristen is one of the better protagonists in the franchise uh kincaid is pretty funny i like him even smaller characters stand out, like, uh, Philip is the first kill in the movie, and, and even he stands out, uh, with him making puppets, and he sleepwalks, so, even he stands out, even though he's not in the film a whole lot. Um, another positive is, uh, I actually do, like, I actually love the two featured songs in this film. Uh, with with um, Into the Fire, uh, I really like that. And The Dream Warriors at the end of the film, that is awesome. Both songs by uh, the band Dokken, uh both those songs are awesome and I love them. Uh, the kills stand out in this movie with uh, Jennifer's head being smashed into the TV. Oh, that's another character that stands out. She wants to be an actress, um, and she kind of gets um, a little screen time with that. So she also stands out. But anyways, back to the kills. Head smash TV thing. Welcome to prime time, bitch. Uh, that, that is a cool kill. That That's... That kill stands out in the franchise, and Philip being walked like a puppet is very creative. So those are two kills that really do stand out in uh, in the movie. And even uh, Taryn as a character and her kill both stand out, uh, getting a drug overdose, and that she was a drug, drug addict. She stands out. She's pretty cool. Uh, the effects... As always, are great. The uh, the sink Freddy hand is pretty cool. Where like the sink faucet turns into a bladed glove. Um, that is uh, pretty cool and creative. Taryn's uh, Taryn's arms when when she gets killed is cool. When she gets a drug overdose, um, uh, and uh, even when. Freddy has the drug needle fingers. Those are cool. Um, when Philip gets killed, the tendons look pretty cool. Br pretty gross, too. Freddy's chest of souls look pretty cool. That that always stands out. And the stop-motion Freddy puppet uh, is, is really cool. Uh, uh, as little as you get to see it, it's still pretty cool. The... The tension in this movie is still really high with, uh, when Philip is about to fall off the building, it's tense. When, when the Dream Warriors are in the nightmare, it's so engaging, uh, and it's just so much fun and kind of scary. Uh, so it's really cool. And my last positive is... I like it that they bring back Nancy as the protector, and they also bring back Donald Thompson to help Nancy's dad. So that's that's really cool. And honestly, I don't have any negatives for this. This is just a really good film. Um, uh, I I can't really think of anything. If if there was anything I had to say about the movie. Uh, that's, that's like, an, that would be a negative was, would be, I don't think it's as scary as the original, but I don't think it's trying to be, so I think this is still just a very good film. So in the end, 
it it's a it's a hard debate, but I do think I I think I do like this one a little bit more than the original Elm Street. Um, Nightmare on Elm Street is one of my favorite horror movies of all time. This is just like one spot above it, so it's it's very hard for me to say which one is better. Um, right now, I'll say Elm Street three. Uh, maybe just because I just watched that recently, so, uh, yeah, um, uh, A Nightmare on Elm Street 3 Dream Warriors, I think, is a very solid, uh, Elm Street sequel, and this is more of, like, a direct sequel to the original instead of, like, Elm Street 2, which is kind of, like, uh, like, a spin-off or something, like, not really that connected, so, so Elm Street 3 is kind of like a, di a direct sequel to the original. I really like Elm Street 3. I approve of Elm Street 3 Dream Warriors. Thanks for watching.